everybody. Happy Memorial Day. I hope you're having a very magical Memorial Day weekend. I have definitely had a very fun weekend. And um, today I did lots of uh, flea marketing. I had two flea markets. Uh, went to Biggie's for lobster roll. I showed you the video just before. One thing we must never forget is what Memorial Day really is about, and that is those brave, brave guys that gave their, and women, who gave their lives for our freedom to be exactly who we are. And we are so lucky and thankful for them. God bless all our past, present, and future warriors. Saturday, as soon as I found out Charlie was out of the hospital and back in his store, I was there too. Um, he had some reel to reels for me. I got Million Seller hit songs of the 60s, 101 Strings. Fabulous. This one is a Tommy Dorsey and Artie Shaw. Of course, Artie Shaw, my favorite, one of my very favorites. Charlie's absolute favorite. And the Banjo Barons, Golden Hawaiian Hits. Fabulous. And I didn't get to show it to you yet because um, uh, I'm still waiting for a, a particular kind of old power cord that I, I think Skeety, Skeety says he may have one because it really was the kind used on old power tools. But I found a beautiful old web core. Uh, I think that the voice of music was a big reel to reel. The web core is even bigger and heavier and very, very atomic. The only thing it was missing was the power cord. And it has this strange um, round two-prong um, built into the machine. So you have to have the kind of extension that you would have popped onto an old power tool with the round, the round and the round female end, but only with two prongs. You can't have the one with the grounder. It wouldn't fit. So Skeety thinks he has one because you know he collects all the old tools and automotive stuff. So I, he's pretty sure he has something that'll fit it. So it's very exciting. Okay, we are listening to, these are also from Charlie. We're listening to Al Kaola, Tough Guitar English Style. And this one was really clean and I, I love it. That's the thing about Charlie's, you know, you have to look at the vinyl. You can't go by the cover because I've gotten some mint stuff that hasn't been touched in forever with a kind of a beat up cover. It's just uh, from years of storage and dampness and it's a very old store, a very old place. So so another thing that was Cy Zentner, the swinging eye, look at that. <laughs> Perfect, right? Oh, private eye music, great. I got a perfect copy of My Cup of Tea by Cy Zentner, um, another British invasion type um, record by Cy. This one, uh, Craig had given me a copy of this, but this one is still in shrink, check it out. And a lot of Beatles covers, which a lot of us love. This is insane, and this was a must have, and I listened to this this morning, I love this. This is awesome. And I never knew this about Clarabelle. Clarabelle, one of the, you know, me and my creepy clowns, Clarabelle. Clarabelle, it was a man. Like what, what kind of name is that for a male clown? But anyway, <laughs> you know, a beloved clown, okay? But he, this is called Clarabelle Clowns with Jazz. And unbeknownst to me, and probably many of you, was that Clarabelle, who was Lou Anderson, was a very accomplished jazz clarinetist. And this record is amazing. It really is. And he even does a jazz version of Be a Clown, which is really fun. This is an awesome record. If any of you see this somewhere, grab it. You will be very impressed. And of course, the creepy clown uh, aspect really really adds to it for me. Oh, and then I found this one. Ron Goodwin's Music in Orbit. Out of the, out of the World Instrumentals by London's Finest Orchestra. Not as exotica as I would have liked, but um, I do always collect the space covers. And this one does have uh, a song on it called Martians on Parade. So, really, really fun. Look at that. 
Okay, that was my Charlie scores. Yesterday I hit one of the big um, thrift shops uh, down by Plain, the Plainfield area, and I found a mint brand new copy of Juana A. Now, Arthur Lyman, Juana A, I have a copy of this um, that I had gotten on eBay, and I paid a good buck for it. But this one, I'm telling you, this was never played. And it still was in shrink. It was open, but it was still in shrink. And I know it was never played, but not only by the condition of the vinyl. I don't think, I don't, I doubt I can capture it. But you know, sometimes a brand new record is hard to push down on the spindle. The spindle hull was tight. It was a, it was absolutely virgin vinyl. It had a tight hull, and I had to push it down on the uh, turntable. It was never played. I can guarantee you. And this is an amazing uh, Lyman record. This so at that thrift, I found another um, creepy clown. <laughs> this is um, what do you call them? Ringling Brothers, greatest show on earth souvenir I collect these whether they're old or new I love um, collecting circus stuff and obviously this is a more modern one I have a couple of, of this type the uh, molded plastic type but I collect them now because I just love the circus stuff the old circus stuff is a lot harder to come by I grab it when I see it but I do collect the new Ringling Brothers stuff too, the newer Ringling Brothers stuff too. This one could be, um, I don't know, 80s, but very, very cool and a very creepy plant. <laughs> okay, today uh, I went to a couple of flea markets. Uh, the second flea market was better and I found a couple of children's records. I found Copycat on Record Guild of America and Frog in the Spring, 78, beautiful. It was so hot. It was so hot. The record, the 78 guy was out in the blazing sun with no shade whatsoever. And I couldn't stop myself from looking through every single record. So I was, I was dying. I mean, it, it was so hot. I, uh, Playland party sounds of this and that and Playland Party, Follow the Leader, also Record Guild, very fun. And then I found uh, Peter Pan 78, Three Blind Mice, There Was a Crooked Man, Little Bo Peep. It's a beautiful, beautiful cricket. Punchy the Clown. And the other side is Yogi. Isn't that beautiful? Just gorgeous. Um, I hope you're all having magical mystical musical memorial day weekends i love you all and i will talk to you very very soon